Bonjour à tous et à toutes, je suis Tenko et je suis ici pour vous présenter un nouvel épisode du Walkthrough de Retour vers le futur. Uh, can you tell me where I can find Doc, uh, Citizen Brown? Are you sure you're an honor student? Where do you think he is at this time of day? At work? That's right, working at the courthouse. Heavy. Pourquoi cette fouille? Hey, what's with the pat down? What do you think, I'm packing heat? Heat, contraband. Contraband? You know. Booze, smokes, bubblegum, dogs, circus bubble peanuts? Bubblegum is illegal? Come on, McFly. You're smart enough to know that ignorance of the Civic Ordinance 2XM isn't an excuse. Quand... Depuis quand vous êtes dans la police? Since when are you a cop? I thought you were a shoe salesman. Are you on something? I've always been a cop. Just like my pa. Great, I've turned my girlfriend's dad into a cop. I've got to finish my beat. Are you going to make trouble for me today? No. No what? No, sir. That's right, citizen. Donc sans plus tarder, on va se diriger vers euh, vers l'interphone. Hill Valley Courthouse. How may I help you, citizen? I need to see Doc or uh, Citizen Brown. Do you have an appointment? No, but... Then I'm afraid you'll have to wait your turn. Citizen Brown's a very busy man. That voice sounds familiar. Mais oui, Marty, tu n'as toujours pas deviné. Il est un peu long à la détente, Marty, comme d'habitude. Hein. Biff? Doc? Doc, wait! I need to talk to you. On va aller voir Biff. Biff? Hey, you're you're George and Lorraine's youngest. Martin, right? What? You don't know me? Only by reputation. Brown Cadet of the Month, three months running. Impressive. Are you interested in the Citizen Plus program? C'est quoi, Citoyen Plus? What is this Citizen Plus? It's Citizen Brown's new re-education program. And I'm the first of Hill Valley's Citizen Plus. Uh, pluses. Plus I? A re-education program? What the hell? Please don't swear, Martin. It makes me uncomfortable. C'était Doc dans la voiture? Listen, Biff. That car I saw you get out of, was that Doc Brown in there with you? Ha! Ah, Doc! That should be his new nickname! But, yeah, that was Citizen Brown. What an inspirational guy. How'd you get FaceTime with him? He seems so busy. You got that right, Martin. Citizen Brown's a busy, busy guy. But fortunately, uh, unfortunately, I'm a special case. See, Martin, I used to be a real bad apple. A real butthead. Twin banana. You a butthead? No. What can I say, Martin? I was always getting into trouble. Too much trouble, what with the booze, the partying, the women. Even my dogs were a pack of trouble. Pack, get it? Uh, yeah. What does this have to do with Citizen Brown? Well, after getting in so much trouble, the authorities, they took me in to see Citizen Brown and gave me an ultimatum. Citizen Plus or Bust. Voilà. Donc là maintenant, on va lui, par... enfin, va lui demander de nous raconter son passé sordide. De façon, euh, bah, on va savoir comme ça ce qui est interdit dans... Cette nouvelle ville, euh, so, ce nouveau uh, about ballet. all the bad things you used to do. Gosh, Martin, I really don't like dredging up the past. But all right, if it'll help you make a decision about Citizen Plus. 
Donc les substances illégales pour commencer. You said something about booze? Beer, rum, whiskey, wine coolers, you name it, I drank it. Not only did I drink it, I smuggled it into Hill Valley too. Chip off the old block, huh? Used to be I'd knock your block off for a comment like that. But yeah, I guess I was following in Pop's crummy footsteps. Donc il n'y a pas une goutte d'alcool à Hill Valley. So there's no booze in Hill Valley. Nope. Sure, someone tries to sneak some in every now and then, but cops like Officer Parker over there always catch them sooner or later. Parle-moi des chiens méchants. Why'd your dogs get you in trouble? You weren't running dog fights, were you? No, nothing that bad. I just used to have a lot of dogs. What's wrong with that? Nothing, other than them keeping the neighbors up all night, lunging at old people, and eating all the squirrels in the park. In fact, I'm ashamed to say it was my out-of-control dogs that were directly responsible for the banning of dogs throughout Hill Valley. You don't sound very ashamed. Oh, I am. Very, very ashamed. Alors, il n'y a plus de chien. So there's no dogs in Hill Valley anymore? Yep. Citizen Edna says they carry diseases and steal shoes. Parlez-moi des femmes illégales. What kind of trouble did you get into with women? They weren't hookers? No, no, nothing like that. It's just that I wasn't always discreet about my affections. What? Public displays of affection, Martin. You know, necking and such. That's illegal? Oh, yeah. Alors, plus aucun témoignage d'affection en public. You seriously got in trouble for PDAs? You bet. The Browns always say that behaviors that excite your privates should be kept in private. Or maybe it's just Citizen Edna who says that. Voilà. J'en ai assez entendu. Uh, let's, let's change the subject. Thanks. I don't like talking about my old nasty self. Comme vous pouvez le voir, c'est vraiment, euh, vraiment n'importe quoi, quoi. Enfin, donc euh, l'alcool est interdit. Euh, on a vu tout à l'heure avec Parker que les, les chewing-gums aussi étaient interdits. Les chiens sont interdits et il est interdit de... Alors ils disent interdit d'embrasser, mais il n'y a pas que ça. C'est aussi interdit de faire la bise. C'est serrage de main. Donc euh, c'est-à-dire que même une mère ne pourra pas faire la bise à son fils par exemple. Enfin, C'est un peu le gros bordel. Euh... Ouais donc ensuite euh, j'ai une chance de pouvoir rencontrer le citoyen Brown. Do you think I could get to see Citizen Brown if I did all the bad stuff you used to do? I guess, but why would you want to act like that? Donc voilà. Euh plus d'anciens bifs, c'est juste pour le fun parce que c'est marrant. So you won't break any rules anymore? Kid, the Citizen Plus treatment makes it physically impossible for me to break rules. How so? Now I get physically ill if I try to break a rule. Euh, la rééducation fait toujours son effet. How's your re-education holding up? Still incapable and uninterested in breaking the rules. Et une petite bière? Sure you aren't craving a beer? I do kind of miss beer. Uh, on second thought, blah! Tu veux te battre? You used to be a real bruiser. That's all behind me now. So what? You wouldn't even defend yourself? I don't know if I could, actually. Wuss. Oh, you're just aching to find out, though. D don't torment me. <laughs> Pauvre, pauvre Biff. I can get used to this. Please, Martin, don't make me angry. All right, Biff, you're off the hook this time. Voilà. See you later, Biff. Bye, Martin. Donc, euh, il peut pas enfreindre les règles, sinon ça le fait vomir. What's Jen up to now? Bon bah on va aller voir Jennifer, histoire d'enchaîner un peu les choses. Salut Jennifer. Jennifer Jen
You got a problem? Euh... Tu m'as laissé tomber. What's the deal, Jennifer? You left me stranded outside the city gates. Yeah, that was pretty rotten, wasn't it? I'm such a horrible role model. Better get away before I corrupt you. Vas-y, corromps-moi. Look, I don't know what you got against me in this timeline, uh, lately, but I'm here to make things right. I've missed you, you know? Take a look at me, Martin. Do I look like the kind of girl that would hang around the president of the Junior Brown Brigade? I don't know what the hell you're talking about, but I gotta admit, I kind of like you like this. Oh, uh, Barf? So do you spend most of your time vandalizing public property? Don't even think about snitching on me. Unless you want this spray can up your... No, no, listen, you got me wrong. I'm looking to, uh, break a few rules myself. You? Où est-ce que je peux trouver un objet de contrebande? Do you know where I could score some forbidden materials? Do I strike you as somebody who would possess illegal substances? Um, kinda, yeah. And you strike me as somebody who would turn in somebody like me. Next topic. Témoignage d'affection en public. This ban on public displays of affection bites. Hey, you're talking about my most favorite legal infraction of all. Yeah? Not with you. Ew! Les tags ne sont pas une infraction majeure? Isn't graffiti a major infraction? You'd think. But after Big Brown had all those buildings coated in that Teflon polymer junk a couple years ago, graffiti's been knocked down to a two demerit offense. Go fig. Je recherche un animal dangereux. What do you know about harboring dangerous animals? So you met my new boyfriend. Oh, lighten up. Peu importe. On second thought, maybe I don't want to know any more about breaking the rules. Wuss. Euh, qu'est-ce que je dois dire sinon Euh... Qu'est-ce que tu penses de moi So, Jennifer. Uh-huh. What do you think of me I don't. <laughs> J'étais populaire avant. Seriously, what have you got against me? I'm kind of popular, right? Very popular. Among a certain crowd. What crowd? Dorks. Qu'est-ce que t'entends par abruti? Marty McFly a dork? It's impossible. He can't be a dork. Okay, anyone who talks about himself in the third person is a dork. Euh, J'ai un plan pour tout arranger à Hill Valley. Hill Valley's totally screwed up, but I got a plan to fix everything. You do, huh? I'm gonna go talk to Citizen Brown and get him to make it all better. That sounds like the kind of plan you'd come up with, weirdo. Bon, pour le moment, de toute façon, je pourrais pas faire grand chose de plus. Your paint's starting to streak. Ah! Donc on fait demi tour. C'est principalement euh, beaucoup de dialogues, comme je vous l'ai dit, hein, surtout là au début parce qu'il y a beaucoup de... C'est un peu... Voilà, donc là il y a Lorraine. C'est un peu l'introduction de... De... Mom? de cette nouvelle ligne temporelle, si on peut dire. Je vous remercie d'avoir regardé cette vidéo et à bientôt pour la suite du walkthrough de Retour vers le futur.